endless battles, the struggles, it was all worth it. The Dark Lantern was within reach. Bray Wyatt would be able to bring its maddening light to his followers. Good evening, I'm the Game Tutor, and tonight we're going to be looking at WWE Immortals on iOS and Android. Based on the Injusted Gods Among Us iOS game, WWE Immortals sees a crazy spin on the WWE universe. Now, when Bray Wyatt's Enchanted Lantern, having been stolen by the Authority, opens up portals to alternate dimensions, summoning in superheroes and villain versions of WWE wrestlers. That sounds awesome. Now, being a wrestling fan and a fan of the Mortal Kombat games, this game really grabbed me straight away. And with its simple pick up and play and a slight pandering to both my wrestling fan and collector nature really got me into it. Fights are three on three and relatively simple. You can perform fast and slow attacks along with a few combos allowing to build up your special bar and unleash super moves. Now these can then be blocked. Now while this all sounds simple, and it is, it's actually quite a solid mechanic that works really quite well. Now as with all free to play mobile games there are microtransactions to behold and while the game does allow you to gain money by playing using real world currency this of course speeds up the process. Now I personally work on the basis that I don't really mind spending on a free to play game what I would spend on a full price game of simulator. nature so I spent £8 on a few characters and to me that seemed pretty reasonable. What is nice is that on the multiplayer side of things you seem to be matched up pretty well against players with equal level characters, meaning that you don't get trounced by rich players, making this game definitely not pay to win. I do feel that some of the prices of things though are particularly high and especially the gear is a little hefty, and there definitely is far too much difference in power between the bronze, gold and silver champions, meaning that at the more advanced stage of the game any non-gold characters are essentially pointless. Now Immortals reimagines the WWE roster in quite an unusual way. We've got the Bella Twins doing their best Elemental Mage, Milana and Katana impressions. Uh, we've got the Undertaker as a Necromancer. The Rock as a kind of Stone Guardian. Roman Reigns as a Centurion. And Daniel Bryan as, well, da Daniel Bryan. Now what is very unusual here is who they've included and who they've left out. Now obviously this roster will be expanded upon. But having Trish Stratus, a WWE diva that we haven't seen on regular television for many, many years included, and not including people such as Bray Wyatt, who does appear, but only in the intro, Dean Ambrose or Seth Rollins or Dolph Ziggler or Ryback or AJ Lee, is a bit of an odd choice, but I'm one that I'm sure we will see these uh, wrestlers in the future. As well as buying new characters, you can also upgrade your character's super moves and add gear to them, although this system does not seem to have much of an effect compared to things such as just advancing your characters. Different pairings of characters also provide bonuses, which just mean that experimenting with different groupings does work quite nicely. Overall, WWE Immortals is a really fun mobile game, and it's got an acceptable micro-transition system that has kept me entertained, and I really look forward to seeing more of it as this game evolves. But more importantly, please, please NetherRealm, make this into a full console game that can happily breach the gap between Mortal Kombat X and whatever new Mortal Kombat game will come after that, much like Injustice did before it. Come on NetherRealm, make it happen. Night night everyone. Night night Andy. Before they fully understood it, the Dark Lantern opened doorways to infinite other worlds where the WWE superstars were knights and mages, superheroes and super villains, strange creatures and mighty warriors. Now, epic brawls rage everywhere. Now is the time of WWE Immortals. If you've enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and please also join up with us on Steam and our social media pages. Come visit us at www.thegametutor.co.uk and also please come and be our patron on Patreon for a chance at cool prizes every month.